how voice fits into sexual empowerment. Um, voice, as I mentioned, is the first element of my nine elements of sexual empowerment that I wrote about in Women on Fire, which is based on the work I've been doing. This wasn't, you know, oh, I'm going to come up with nine things. It, this was, this was just me really looking at the conversations I was having, the work I was doing with people, and voice, without a doubt. Is the first element because it is essential and it takes time to work on it is so fundamental to every other element of sexual empowerment that it is always the place where I begin whether I'm working with private clients or in my programs always 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 do that so um, so stepping fully into your voice really overcoming those beliefs that have kept you small and learning clear communication and self-awareness tools that help you to show up uh, much more strongly in your voice, in, in communication, in relationship. Um, and again, it's both that internal and external voice. The, the second element is release. And there are so many things that we need to release in order to step into our sexual power. Some of those things have to do with the beliefs and the stories that have kept us feeling like a victim when it comes to our sexuality or not good enough or just not feeling powerful in some way. And so, we might have some past shame, some guilt, or even trauma that we need to release. There's lots of things that might be holding us back. And certainly our voice is a key part of that. And it's a key part of how we do the releasing, right? A lot of it is in telling our stories or in emoting, in letting it out in some way. Your voice is so powerful. I can't even, um, I, I can't even underline this enough how powerful it is. So learning to also use your voice for the releasing as well as using it in and around sex is key. The third element is emotion. Um, in our work on sexual empowerment, emotion and voice are so interconnected, as I just said, right? The voice is imbued with intense emotion or with the emotional patterns that are showing up that either take us into our power or keep us from feeling powerful, right? Um, if we're not using our voice to step up, we're, then we might be using it to manipulate. We might be using it to keep ourselves small, to show our insecurities, right? Or to protect ourselves from being vulnerable rather than stepping into it. So learning to cut through the emotional patterns and use our voice in a powerful way is so core to overcoming all of the things that hold us back. Again, not just sexually, but in everything. And so if we can break through it sexually, we can break through it in every other part of our life, okay? The fourth element is body. We need to give voice to our body. Sometimes the feeling uh, is in your body that something just isn't right, right? Or that your body's yearning for something, or that um, there, there's like a, a signal your body is giving you and you're unable to translate that in words. So learning to listen to your body, to talk about your body, to understand what it is saying to you and how it works and what it likes is critical to having good sex and also to really living fully in your body. So taking care of your sexual health and enjoying being in your body, of course, is related to voice. Your body can't get all of its needs met without a voice. The, the fifth element is desire. Desire also needs a voice or it becomes painful, unrequited longing. So to long for something can be intense and it can even be invigorating at first. But if you are unable to ask for what you really want, desire becomes frustrating. It becomes out of reach. So many women have so many issues that come up around sexual and erotic desire. And your voice is a tool that is absolutely essential in fulfilling your desire. In my experience, many people have a lot of issues come up around desire. Um, it is truly probably the most common thing that shows up um, in the people that I work with. So there's a lot of tools around meeting that desire. The, the next element, the sixth one is permission, right? So giving yourself permission to want what you want, to like what you like, to not like what you don't, to express yourself fully and to have new experiences is something we all need to learn. And so both your internal and your external voice come into play with permission because you've got to do it internally before you take action around the things that you want, you know, before you can fully externalize the things that you want to say. Um, 
So you get to make it okay and you get to give yourself permission to talk about sex and to be bold in your expression. You get to be that person. Um, play is the seventh element. So part of play is sexual skills, um, some of which are cert certainly uh, birthed out of playing, you know, finding the things you like and then choosing to develop them into skills. One of the core skills we all need is, of course, communication skills. So again, we're circling back to the importance of voice when we get to that place of learning to play and developing skills putting into words the kind of play that we want, and also using our voice to play through flirtation, through seduction, right? Through playing with power, all the playgrounds that we're creating, right? It's, it's so core. The eighth element is home. And so this is where our internal voice and our external voice get to become aligned and authentic. So when you come home to the sexual self, you love who you are, you accept where you are, you stop people pleasing, and you start living from your truest place at home in yourself. When you're at home, you become far more powerful. You become the agent of your destiny. You stop leaving yourself, abandoning yourself to go get the validation outside, to go get love to go control somebody else right you use your words and your aligned actions to come from a place of home there is alignment that is what we want that is how we want to show up in relationship if you show up in relationship from that place of home your relationship is going to go to a totally different place and that's not the game most people are playing you don't need anybody else your happiness is not anyone else's responsibility. You don't need to be validated by somebody else. You get to be fully at home and tuned into yourself and come from that place. That is power. And then the ninth element is fire, right? So that's the fire, the core energy inside of us that drives everything we do. It's the powerful center that we birth everything from, right? Inside out. Our fire demands a voice. It magnifies all that it is, good or bad, right? So we can give voice to our powerful, creative, sexual energy, and we can beam it out into the world as we become our most powerful self. How are we nourishing and expanding our sexual energy? How are we utilizing it to improve everything in our lives? Stepping into your sexual voice will forever change how you approach sex how much you enjoy it, and how you step into your power in your life. The ripple effects of working on your voice are so tremendous, so tremendous. So no matter where you are with the things that I'm talking about, that powerful voice is inside of you. It absolutely is. Every single one of us has that voice. So I want to talk to you about someone who really set out to heal and step into her sexual voice and power because her story inspires me so much. Um, Teresa came into my work as a single mom and as a therapist who had spent much of her life taking care of other people. She had worked through the trauma of being sexually abused, but she knew that there was so much more that she could experience. And she felt blocked from receiving pleasure and being able to orgasm. And she was unsure of how to find a fulfilling relationship where she could open up. She didn't know what she wanted. She didn't know how to talk about sex. And even though she was a therapist who helped others, she didn't have that. That wasn't easy to do, right? Sometimes it's hard to do it for yourself, even though you might help others with it. And she didn't want to pass her hangups about sexuality to her daughters. And she knew that she had to stop prioritizing other people's needs and give herself room to grow. She had to learn about her own authentic sexuality and she needed to give it a voice. And so she came into my, my work. She did my, uh, my Love Skin Women's program. And nine months later, Teresa shared that her life had completely transformed. I mean, we got to watch her transform. Her confidence and her acceptance of her body were through the roof. 
She had attracted great partners, yes, plural, with whom she could explore sexual play and intimacy on a whole new level. She was having so much fun and feeling stronger in all areas of her life, including with her family and at her challenging job. The blocks were gone and they were replaced by a sense of confidence and ease and self-acceptance and this juicy vibrancy she had. She was in her body, right? She had learned more about what her real desires were and then had learned how to talk about them, had learned to talk about sex, to figure out what she wanted, to ask for it, to, and really watched her skills impact not just the lovers she attracted, but she also really opened up dialogue about sexuality with her two older teen daughters who were leaving the nest. They were going off to college. And that part just, it, 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 it makes me so happy every time I think of it because it changed not just her own, <clears throat> her own life, she changed the lives of her whole family, right? It changed their lives to be able to have real conversation about sexuality. One of her daughters ended up coming out as queer not that long after that. And so the whole family was impacted by her stepping into her own voice and her power and agency. So we affect the people that are around us. We do. It's so, so important to understand the ripple effects. So what if you could experience a level of sexual connectedness sexual self-esteem and sexual fulfillment far beyond what you've had before. Um, would you put in some effort to have that? Would you develop the skills and the perspective that you are missing? Would it be worth your energy and time? Right? I believe that it would because it is that important, right? So. I'm not sure why you showed up today, but I bet it could be for a number of reasons, you know, and I'm seeing even in the, the chat and, and the questions and the things that people sent in ahead of time. Um, I hear you. I hear where you are. I see where you are. I, and I will answer more questions in a few minutes. Um, you might have showed up because you feel disconnected from your body, your sexuality, and your pleasure. And maybe from your partner, if you have one. Maybe you showed up because you don't know what you want sexually or how to ask for it. Maybe you showed up because you feel sexually unsatisfied or inadequate or unfulfilled in some way and you're tired of feeling like you're missing out on something. Maybe you showed up because you don't want to stay quiet about your sexuality anymore, period, right? Sexual fulfillment is up to you. And I know you might be asking yourself, is it really possible for me to create the sexual life I really want? because sometimes it can feel unattainable, like in the question we answered a, a little while ago. But the answer is definitely yes. It is possible if you want it. If you decide you're really gonna go for it and you're gonna create it for yourself and look at the many, many things that that could mean for you and your life. So the way I see it, you've got two options. You know, you can stay in the dissatisfaction, the confusion, the disconnection, the frustration, the resentment, or even the anger about where you are. And you can continue not to communicate about your sexuality, your desires in your body, or to communicate and not get your needs met and not know what the gap is about. Most people live this way about sex. Most people do. They stay in that place and they will stay there till their death, you know, or till their partner's death or whatever it is. So you can choose that, or you can choose to invest in your own sexual self-development and create the deeper intimacy that you really want. You can build your skills and confidence so that you can really create more satisfaction in all parts of your life because you know you are the one in charge and you get to create the relationships and the sexual life that you want. And that's real. And that choice is yours. That choice is nobody else's. That choice is yours. 
And so I'm sure you, you probably know what I hope you will choose. And so if you choose the second, I would like to invite you to join me and a powerful group of women in a deep sexual evolution this year in Firewoman. Firewoman is launching now. We start this month. This is Firewoman is a year long intensive virtual program that is designed to help women deeply explore the depths of their sexuality, discover what it is they really want and what they don't want in sex and relationships and intimacy and break through the patterns that hold them back to heal their tender places and to develop tools that create the fulfilling sexual and intimate life they want. We work on countless tools in this program. There is healing, there is that level of healing, there is the level of witnessing, there is the level of connection and building intimacy, there is the level of practicing, and there is the level of developing those new tools, all of which you get to take into your actual life. So who's right for this? This is for women, people who identify as women and also non-binary people who were assigned female at birth, all welcome. This is for all sexual orientations, all ages and backgrounds. I can tell you most of the women in here are in their 30s to their 50s. We sometimes get younger ones in their 20s and we sometimes get, as I said, women in their 60s and 70s. The bulk of people I think that, that jump in and really uh, 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 dive into this work are in 30s to 50s. Half of them are in relationships, half of them are not. Um, and they are women from around the world. We have women from a lot of different countries that join us for this program. I've designed it so that people can do it wherever they are in the world. Um, and generally people have some kind of prior experience with self growth and that kind of thing, therapy, yoga, the coaching, counseling, whatever. Um, but that's not a requirement. Um, so here's, here's what we do. We do nine monthly teaching classes on the nine elements. We do an element each month and we go deep. Um, I teach those with you. I give you home play assignments to work on. Um, we go through those nine elements and we also work through 12 sexual archetypes that impact us. Um, and then two weeks later, after each of those nine calls, we do a community call where you get live coaching from me. Um, all of the calls are interactive, but this one is even more so. It is really driven by what the women want to talk about. We go deep into the issues that are coming up for you, the kinds of questions people are asking today. We go there and deeper and deeper. Um, and we really get underneath the things that are holding people back. You can get that coaching from me um, and we, we do that together. Um, in the other three months, we do bonus rituals, bonus calls, bonus teachers. There's a whole bunch of other things we do. I provide some of my classes on sex and money um, because I want it to be a full year of such empowered work that women get to do um, with each other. So I also really believe in doing the live work, right? Showing up live, showing up in the room together. So I am gifting you a half price ticket to my Firewomen retreat, my live event that's happening this year, May 1st through the 3rd in New York at the Menla Retreat Center. So as part of the program, I will give you a half price ticket to that. Um, I will even give you a discounted bring a friend ticket to if you want to bring a friend with you because sometimes it's easier to come into those environments with a friend. Um, a lot of amazing women have come through this event over the last three years. This will be our fourth year and it is our first year bringing it to the East Coast. So we will be in New York this year. Um, you will get a personal copy of my book if you already have it and you want uh, Lesbian Sex Secrets for Men, I'll send you that. So whichever book you want, I will send you a personal copy. You'll have membership to the online portal with all the resources, assignments, the call recordings, all the class materials. I give the women in this program everything. I want them to have all the tools and all the things. They ask me for something, I put it in there if it's not already in there. Um, it is a really amazing, uh, really amazing treasure trove of um, resources for you. Um, you will have membership to the private Firewoman Facebook group with all of the women who um, are doing and have done this course. And you will also get a personal buddy to connect with on a weekly basis throughout the program to help you stay on track if you want it. So if you want to buddy up with someone, we will uh, support you in, in buddying up and 
partnering with someone that makes sense um, as you go through the work. Not everybody wants it, but most people do. And I can say that women years later will still be um, having regular calls with their buddies because they built so much intimacy with them in this work. So um, it's a very meaningful way to track each other and to create um, a deeper friendship with someone in the program. So this doesn't set you up for total success in breaking through the things that you want to break through around your sexuality. I don't know what will. I mean, honestly, we this is our this will be our fifth cohort coming through this program since my book came out. Um, we started it actually just before the book came out, and we've had so many women come through this. It is tried and true. We have honed it. We have zeroed in on what works and what doesn't, and we continue to always uh, listen to the feedback and make it better. And it is such a strong program. Um, there is no doubt in my mind, I can say this with such confidence, there is no doubt in my mind that it will change your sexual life, it will change how you show up in all of your relationships through this work. If you really show up in Firewoman, you really do the work, there's no way things are not going to change. It is so powerful to do this work and to do it in a context with other people, with other women who are witnessing you, with a, with, a, with a group of people that are there with you. As I said, I'm going to actually, I've never done this. This is a course I sell actively right now. Someone just bought it. Uh, I sell it, uh, the, my Claim Your Orgasm video course. I decided as a generous bonus, I'm gonna put this in. I'm gonna add this uh, to for all of the women who uh, sign up for Firewoman. If you apply and you sign up in this next week, I will give you this bonus. It's a $600 bonus. Um, it is all of, it's over 20 videos on orgasm, pleasure, anatomy, toys, sex, all of it. Um, communication, also some stuff in there. Um, there are five teaching model modules that will help you develop your sexual abilities and experience more pleasure and look at how to get those, those needs met through that communication. So as I said, it's very, very uh, linked and the teachings are uh, in alignment. You'll get all of the worksheets and the handouts and the transcripts of that course in addition. And you can do that at your leisure because you will have access to that portal. So, um, so that is a really exciting bonus. I'm also gonna offer a 60 minute sexuality activation call with me. Um, so generally, I for an initial call with me, I charge three ninety seven. I'm going to waive that, and we get to dive in. We get to dive into what it is you want, what it is you're wanting to create, the things that are in your way. Get underneath that. Look at the patterns, and look at what is the pathway forward for you. So I will be there to really guide you. You will have that call with me. Th these are limited, so it's really first come, first serve. I only have so much time, um, but I will offer as many of those as I can. Um, and as I mentioned, everybody who's here today gets that strategies and scripts for having difficult conversations worksheet, which I know Molly put the link in for. Um, so as I said, you'll get the signed copy of my book. You're also gonna get my Firestarter recordings, which are 15 minute recordings with a variety of experts on things that can help you um, develop other kinds of practices for your sexuality. Um, so I did uh, those fire starter recordings and um, they've just been kind of quiet over there. I'm like, I just want to gift those. I'm going to give them to everybody who signs up and I'm also going to gift you um, my 2021 sexual New Year's virtual ritual, um, which I do every year. This will be my gosh, 12th year, I think, doing it. Um, so I've been teaching this for a long time. I offer it at the beginning of each year to really vision your sexual and relationship life for the year. So I'm also going to gift you that. There's so many bonuses. It's over $1,000 in bonuses, well over $1,000 in bonuses to do this. So um, I really want you to apply if you know your sexuality is your key to your wholeness, to your fulfillment. You've, you're, you're tired of waiting for it to change. You're ready to commit. You wanna prioritize it. You wanna prioritize your relationships and yourself in a new way. Um, I want to gift this to you. I wanna, I wanna see this happen for you. So if you are really ready to show up and you wanna do that in a, an amazing sisterhood, a group of people that will really support you, um, even in those moments that feel vulnerable and scary, this is the time. This is my invitation to you. There is so much more. 
If you're getting a lot just from this time together today, imagine what you would get over an entire year of guidance with me and education and really building intimacy with other people. These are muscles that we have to flex, we have to exercise and we get to practice. So you'll apply to the program, um, you'll hop on what normally it would have been just an, an interview with me, but we will hop on a sexuality activation call. Um, we will really look at what is going on for you. And, um, and then we'll, we'll review it. And if we know that you are a fit and we want to invite you, we will invite you to be a part of Fire Women. You'll put down your deposit. This is how it works. We, we really curate our groups. And I want to be really clear about this. It's very important. We have amazing groups of women that come together because we curate them. We make sure you're right for them. I'm not interested in anyone that's not right for this work. That is my guarantee. I will not push you into work you are not right for, or that, or, or if I feel like we're not a good fit and I'm not the right teacher for you, I'm not gonna push you towards it. I'm going to invite you if you are right for it. And if it's not a fit, I might be able to recommend some, something else. And I, I believe in this so much that uh, if you attend all classes and the live event and you do all of the assignments showing that you have completely applied yourself to this work, at the end you feel you didn't get the value and the growth from the program, I will refund your tuition. That is how much I believe in this program. That is how much I believe in this program. I can honestly say I've never done that and I've been offering this guarantee for all these years. Um, because it is that powerful. So you'll go to amyjogoddard.com slash firewoman application. Um, I am happy to, to answer more questions here. So um, I'm going to take a few minutes to do that. Um, possible to get a rough idea on the price for firewoman. It is less than what you would pay for therapy in a month. Um, I can tell you the deposit is $8.97, so you would put down a deposit of $8.97 and then you could do monthly payments. Um, we just changed the pricing, I actually don't have it right in front of me, but it is less than what you would pay for therapy in a month. And I can guarantee you, you will get more than you would get from most therapists if you wanted to go to a therapist for help on your sexuality. Because this is, this is the game that I'm playing on a regular basis, this is what I do. So, um, so this is not to say that there are not therapeutic issues. There often are, and I will, I will refer people out to therapy for those particular things. And a lot of times what people need is not necessarily therapy. They need the skills, they need the support, they need the tools, and they need the practice and the guidance to be able to actually put it into practice in their lives. And that's what we do. That is why it is so effective. My, my master's degree is in human sexuality education. I studied education, I studied the tenets of education and what makes it education effective. And all of that goes into this. And I actually train other educators on how to do that, how to write effective curricula. So my curricula, I can stand in so, solid, so solidly and confidently because this is, this is truly one of my superpowers. It is what I know how to do. I know how to put the things in there that I that people need and I've been doing the work long enough that I know what those things are so I am so excited for any of you that are ready to say yes if what I am saying resonates with you say yes apply let's have a call if you decide it's not for you there's no you, you don't have to do anything there's no obligation I am making this available to people who are seriously ready and interested and want to do it, right? If, if you feel that pull, that tug in you, then apply. It's not, you're not uh, beholden to anything. Let's investigate and see what's there. That's, that's my ask of you and that's my invitation of you today. So I would love to, to work with you. Um, it is, we have already an amazing group, an international group that are coming together. We've got women from different countries. There's some fantastic people um, that are already in the group. So, um, so yes, we are getting ready literally in the next week to start this program. So I, I'm ready to invite, you know, the people that are ready for this. I want you to come and come to the retreat. Um, and if we get on the call and there's something else and you want to do more of my in-person work or something like that, we can talk about that. We can figure out what is the best fit for you. So again, it's amyjogoddard.com 
slash firewomen application. I will look forward to seeing some of your applications for firewomen program. Um, I would love to see some of you at firewomen retreat, um, if not at both. And so uh, I, will, I will be looking for that and we will follow up with you. I've made some times in, in my schedule um, over the next several days to talk to people, to have those calls. So, um, so let's, let's get on the call and let's do it. Um, it's, it's about to happen. It starts next week. And I would love to have you on the first call. You know, even if you miss the first call, it's okay. You can still do it, but this is the time. So people that sign up this week are going to get the claim your orgasm course in addition. So it's a pretty big bonus I'm offering. So please do go to amyjogoddard.com slash firewomen application. And I will see you all, I hope, very, very soon. Thank you.